It's Feedback Gaming. Welcome back to my Mamluk series in Europa Universalis 4. Cradle of Civilization. So here's the situation with the war at the moment. Uh, the Ottomans have slightly more troops than me, but not much. It's pretty close, to be fair. The only reason they have more is because they're hiring a lot of mercs. That means their economy is, ta is tanking and their manpower's dead. My manpower's dead too, but I don't have any mercs. So now I think about it, they're hurting their professionalism by hiring mercs. That's one thing I just totally forgot about that's built within the game. See if I can find their professionalism now. Here we go, professionalism. So we're definitely number one. We were already number one a long time ago, but the Ottomans now have dropped all the way down to here. Every time you hire a merc, I think you lose 0 0.25 maybe? I'm not sure actually, does it say? 0 0.15 per merc. So you hire, how's that? About six and you lose one, don't you? Have I calculated that wrong? I think I might have. But regardless, you don't have something you really want to do because it's hurting your, your best dudes. So at this point, I don't want to engage the Ottomans anymore. I'm actually going to let them engage the Ottomans. Um, I would ideally like to take some of these eastern provinces. They're going to get beaten up now. I can feel it. Oh, maybe not. Because they're tech 11. These guys are tech 10. Tech 10. Yeah, so maybe not. Okay, we need to let's work on our states. That's one area that you have to maximize your potential. Because otherwise you're going to fall behind with states and territories. Okay, so development. Lower Yemen. Oh, it even says on the screen, doesn't it? So where's, where's Lower Yemen? Is it, I assume it'd be here, wouldn't it? Here we go, Lower Yemen. This is going to cost quite a bit of admin as well, isn't it? Central Ethiopia. Upper Yemen. I see a pattern forming. Uh, Dongabala. It's this one, isn't it? Oh, we maxed. Oh, we're already maxed. Never mind. Doesn't the end of these ideas give us more states? No, it was this one. So maybe administrative was the right one to go for if you was going to maximize my income. Okay, so I don't mind if the Ottomans are starting to push back a wee bit. Whoa, did you just consider attacking me then? You fool. Uh, local production or extra admin? No, admin. Admin the long run. Thinking about the long run, boys. I'm gonna go here. 25. Why not? Go here. Add the cores on. Give them more of the holy la. Ooh, that was a suicide mission. So I don't think they're going to be very generous with this peace deal. I don't think that's going to happen. We're lucky to probably gain one stay off them. 34% war score. Uh, blockades. Are costing me quite a lot of war score too. What are you doing down here, boys? Oh! You sieged me! Whoa! I wasn't even paying attention. Okay, well that's like a lesson for you. Always paying attention. Wow, they siege that so quickly. Hmm, maybe some of the changes in the mechanics in the game is affecting how quick you siege, because some of that siege was lightning fast. Was I wasn't even aware it was happening, and it had already been complete. I think he maybe did artillery bombardment. That's the only conclusion I can think of. Where are you going? 
Seriously, where are you? Wipe you. Uh, there should be a stable government. Lose admin, lose prestige, lose a little bit of diplo. Yeah, a little bit of diplo. Wipe. Are they... Oh, they've... they've what? Oh, do you think they white pieced? I think they probably did. All right, so we actually need to fight them now. Ooh, took a lot of losses there. I'm going to suicide a, a few of their troops. Really? How did... How did they even get there? Uh... <laughs> I don't know how they even got there. <clears throat> Occupying any forts in the area. But the only fort in the area is this one. So, kind of a strange... Okay. A bit confused by that one. Alright, let's bring our guys down and let's mush these, po these pockets in the south. I'm trying to siege our capital down. So sneaky. Where are you going? Chump? Really? Infertile, which is kind of not really that applicable for me as my current government type doesn't... Scholars disagree. That seems to be one that fires. I think that probably would make sense firing if I hold high legalism. Yeah, that, that kind of fits into the legalism thing. Does it? Oh, wipe! Wipe them, boys. Got them. We're having a really hard time with manpower though, aren't we? How long can we maintain this? I'll never know. Are they gonna funnel through and suicide? I think that might be the end of the war there. And they're just, they're doing this solely on mercs, too. Alright. They won't actually accept a piece as well. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. They have getting high war exhaustion, too, but they still won't call it quits. All right, I think we're gonna have to make consolidate our stacks to see if we make a big one. Uh, relations becomes hates. Oh, uh, the schools disagree with each other, don't they? Uh, move towards mysticism or legalism. No, legalism is the way forward, boys. Do we rush the cannon? Yeah, sure, why not? I think we're going to have to kick. Um, I think we're going to have to kick Tunisia out of this war. 6-2 is our best guy. He is a god. Are you going to run away? No, nope, you are actually going to fight me. All right, let's just kick these guys out of the war for the time being. They're sieging that Northern Territory pretty quick too. They must have an army of literally all mercenaries. They're probably absolutely thrashing their own durability here. Uh, professionalism. Um,
The Ottomans are now at 36%. They are. They're hiring a complete Merc army. So, what, what do I take from that? It means that if I beat them in this war... Which I have beat them in this war. Can we ask for money off them? Yeah, we can. We can take... Money's really not what we need right now, but whatever. Alright, so what's the consequences of what just happened there? We've just lost our whole standing army. But the positive note is we lost no professionalism. They lost... They lost almost over half of their professionalism fighting. Why are you going, dude? Go here. Yeah. So, that's an interesting trade-off there, isn't it? That's really something to think about, isn't it? Because usually, in emergency situations, if you were really rich, you just spam mercs. And it'd be okay strategy, but now you're paid for it in the long run by... Oh, really? Well, actually, that's okay, because we're making them happy. And we need them to make happy, because we need that manpower recovery. Uh... Not sure if we want to pull that off yet. 43 years old, that's fine, he ain't gonna die. Famous last words. Secrets of our alliance, who cares? Can we keep our royal marriage going, please? Do we still have that? School of Islam? Yeah, we do. Uh, where's the... Is the sword guy still around? Yeah, he is. It's interesting to see when schools of Islam get destroyed and they're no longer the list anymore. Because this list was like, was about down here. I had to scroll it, but now it's all gone. But the good news is all the good ones are still around anyway. The good ones being development reduction and admin cost reduction and shock. This one's a bit of a confusing one though. And the merchant one I get at the start is a bit, eh. I don't know, I'm not sure I'm a big fan of that. All right, we said we're going to get rid of you. Uh, replace him with... Reinforce rate isn't the same as manpower recovery, is it? We'll go for you. You're cheap. I bet our professionalism is growing really slow now. 0.4%, yep. A war against you ain't happening anytime soon either. Yep. All right, how's everything else going? So we could go for the diplomatic and then convert, mass convert. I think we'll say that for just a little bit longer. Yeah, we'll cut, we'll say that for a little bit longer because we'll, we'll tech up, we'll get some ideas and then we'll also culture convert as well. I don't know why I just spent that when I said I was going to hold on to that. Never mind. No. Yes. Lots of you. Lag, you're good. You're good. Need you. No. No. I feel like I'm... The way I'm playing the game at the moment is I'm kind of playing for a long-term investment. I'm planning this stage of the game to be my weakest, where I snowball to a late game. And I'm doing that by really, really being smart about my investments for the future. Leading vassal alliance with Poland. How's our alliance with Poland going anyway? I feel like I've not heard from them. Allied with you. Whoa! I didn't realize they controlled all of this. This is an inheritance, isn't it? They've gained that through a royal marriage. Oh, hang on. They don't. Don't Muslims don't have personal unions? They don't, do they? Corruption. Growing of the printing press. I'll have the corruption, I don't care. Alright, um... We are really far ahead on tech, so I think spending this now is good. And... Oh, we saved the points as well, so there's an incentive to save the points. You gain 150 points, but you only need 100 to fire it. So I could save an extra 50, couldn't I? I never thought of that. Okay, so let's culture convert again. 
we organizing these in the right list yet? These are cheaper, aren't they? They've got to be. No, they've got to be. Jaffa. I'm nervous that these aren't actually cheaper. If I culture convert. So it seems kind of strange to me, but... It says all manpower costs reduced by 5% for everything, but this is not getting affected by that. That's kind of disappointing. Could say goodbye to Syrian. I'm sitting on a lot of money, aren't I? I think my... My choices... Uh, when it comes down to spending my money is a little bit silly. Because I think I should be buying more expensive advisors, shouldn't I? Missionary strength or unrest reduction. This guy, isn't it? Oh, and he's Egyptian too. Sweet. 3.44 ducats a month for a plus 3 guy. Wow. I remember in the old days of EU3 that the higher skill they had, the, the more their stats scaled as well. That was actually kind of cool. Military leader has died. Rip. Alright, so we are completely abandoning the idea of mercenaries. The idea of mercenaries is not cool. Lack of... Oh. Well, the good news there is we didn't lose much. Something is stirring. Apparently they're going to attack Venice. We turn, turn off their money? Yeah, we have. They're going to attack Venice. Why Venice? Gonna take their islands, maybe? Oh, it's because they're attacking Albania, are they? Is that the reason why? I'm not really doing too well with generals at the moment, they're all dying. Okay, so you are quite big and semi-scary, allied with Rwana. Where's Rwana? Is it somewhere here, hidden away? They're a fetish nation as well, aren't they? Yep. I've got decent development too, so I want to annex them. Annex them. Can't see... If they've got any forts. There's one in their capital. There's one here. And it is fully maintained too. It's fully maintained because they've got a claim on them. So they're, they're kind of already semi-aware that we're going to attack in them soonish. Alright, split. Go here. Yeah, I'm aware of that. You guys go first. You guys go here. That's good. Coptic zealots are about to spawn. Oh, we're going the right way then.
Boom. Oh, wow, that was well-timed as well. Nice. Goddamn shrewd. Free manpower, I need that. Uh, free money, yes. Is that almost my... M wow, that completely refreshed near enough all my manpower. Wow. All right, so this is our strike army. Uh, okay. And then the um, horses go on you. Probably don't need... Oh, I completely forgot about the... Uh, these conversions. So we've got the conversion one. Unify culture. That is very difficult to do. We have a very, very large culture group. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think... Maybe we'll do it right at the end, maybe? I don't know. Ship production, mercenaries... War score versus other religions, nah. blockade, siege impact, resistance of reformation. Um, that's a pretty good one. The printing press is born, isn't it? Yep. All right, so we're going to declare war now on you. And we're going to take you out. To be fair, you should just go straight for the, the fort. These guys have got 11 military. We're on 13, so we'll crush them in every opportunity. Broke the fort in one day. Wow, wow, wow. You guys running away from me? Where are you going? I want this guy here. This is a center of trade. Where are you going? Oh, here you are. Time to get wrecked. Get him. So where's Rwanda? Oh, it's here. Rwanda. That's how it's pronounced, isn't it? Yep. Got him. Oh, we're intercepting some mercs as well. They've slandered our merchants. Wow. How are we doing with our trade as well? 61%. 60%. 11%. 64%. Okay. Yep, land maintenance reduction, and we're way, 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 way ahead, so why not? For completing it, we get more trade power. Okay, so it seems to be a trade... I think it's the Mamluks, in, in short, is a, is a trade-based nation, isn't it? Oh, we've lost our best general. Get a lot of high maneuver, guys. Not really that useful. Where are you going? Got him. It's a cannon on its own, okay. Didn't even fight. Insta wipe. You seriously? Oh, okay. All right. Fair enough. Just pillaging my countryside, my beautiful countryside. Say so it's countryside. It's actually desert, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Uh, has uh, granted us 20 years for scholars. Can we not renew it? We're not good enough. Can renew it now though, can't we? No, I don't want that. Where are you going? Is that enough? Like, please, no. Don't want to end it like this.
This is not cool. Good rebels for Ethiopian separatists. Okay. I imagine they're probably more upset because I've been converting them as well. Uh, legalism. Feels like legalism is this, it's nice. I guess the only advantage to the other side is you get that extra 10% morale damage, which is, is really good. You can't underestimate morale damage. It's just literally extra damage for your armies. Where are you going? Are you? Is this a retreat? I think it is, isn't it? It is, yeah. Got him. And that's their whole country occupied, isn't it? Yep. We get him. We got him. They are completely occupied. Rwanda's a weird one. Oh, it's because they're fetish. I was wondering why. Oh, they're not connected. They're really far away. Why are they even allies? It's because they're the same religion. Really? We can tech up at this point? Okay. So we need this one. Uh, local merchants out competed. Okay. Okay. So this one can be demolished now. These three are actually a nice fortified wall. I like that. Um. Alright, we're all up to date now. We can drop the forts too. So there's two choices to make, isn't there? Do you either slacken standards to gain free manpower, or do you hire mercs? That's the question you should always ask yourself. What will benefit you the most? Hmm. Alright, I think we can do some more conversions too. Can't do that. Is that because we're coring? That's fine. When does religious zeal go in this state? Where is it? 1559, okay. Kind of bugs me, this random province high up there. I want to vassalize you. We can do that now. Uh, we get an extra free slot, so why not? Raw marriage. And then alliance. And then. And give us your trade power. And then boost relations, and then we can vassalize. Pretty much just integrating them into our country, aren't we? Piece by piece. Ethiopian separatists. Merchant guild gains influence, gains two tack base. I cannot say no to that. That's freebie. I love those that event. You know what? This is like an incentive in this game not to assign uh, merchants to estates. Because that event that fires gives free extra development. So it feels like it's not the best to assign. It's just best to leave it almost. It's what it feels like. Anyway. Players don't. 
Oh my god, are we losing this? We are losing this. Oh no! <laughs> no, please. No! <laughs> oh no! Manpower! A precious manpower! I was not even prepared for that as well. What? Where have you come from? Oh my damn, there's two stacks that appeared. <laughs> well. Beaten up by the native Ethiopians. How I feel. I feel like I feel like the Italians in the first invasion, guys. I feel so humiliated. Those history memes. Alright. More Fungian separatists. I need to be prepared for when they spawn. Anything I can do to... So the next step now is I feel like this area is secured. I guess... I guess if I was thinking of attacking now, I'd push into here, but then we have to deal with these guys here, which would be kind of annoying. So Actually, they could siege all this desert area, I don't care. So there's two choices right now. We can either make a push towards you and create a buffer against the Ottomans so we can c fulfill our objectives of taking the uh, Caucasian region. Hmm. Choices, eh? There's a few gold provinces around here too, isn't there? I feel like that might be something objective to go for. Yeah, maybe I'll push towards the gold in Africa. Oh, there's gold here too. Oh, I should have taken that one. There's a 0 0.12 chance that the mine depleted each year, halving its production. What is the production? Still pretty low anyway. Alright guys, if you enjoyed this episode, remember to like and subscribe, drop us a comment below, and apart, apart from that, I hope you have a good day. See you soon. Bye-bye.